Something that I would tell a child who longs for their OFW mother is that whatever she is doing overseas is for the benefit of their own good, that she loves them very, very, very much, and she'll sacrifice a lot for her, him or her, and one day she will be in their arms again and everything will be all right. Alam mo ba na ang kauna-unahang Filipina na nakapag-represent sa Miss Intercontinental twice ay si Kristilyn McGarry. Noong taong 2010, nirepresent niya ang Pilipinas sa Miss Intercontinental and she ended up as top 15. Kung nagtataka kayo kung bakit twice, well, noong sumali siya sa Binibining Pilipinas 2015 kung saan nanalo si Pia Wurzbach as Miss Universe Philippines, siya ang nakakuha ng Binibining Pilipinas Intercontinental at nirepresent niya ulit ang Pilipinas sa Miss Intercontinental 2015 where she ended up as first runner-up. Marahil nagtataka kayo kung paano niya nirepresent ang Miss Intercontinental twice. Noong taong 2010, siya ang mutya ng Pilipinas Asia Pacific. Siya ang pumalit kay Janina Lizardo na mutya ng Pilipinas Intercontinental 2010 para irepresent ang bansa sa Miss Intercontinental. Maraming nagulat sa pagbabalik ni Christine McGarry sa Miss Universe Philippines 2024. Well, to be honest, noong taong 2015, if not Janice Lubina or... Pia words back, Christeline McGarry has the highest chance to become Miss Universe Philippines. Sa taong ito, ano sa tingin mo ang kanyang placement? To all my fans and supporters, maraming maraming salamat sa inyo. You guys are amazing. I wouldn't be doing this or couldn't do this without you guys. So just want to make you guys proud. Love you guys. Uh...